my name is Hector with Tequila Reviews and More. And today we are going to make some infused tequila. For that, we are going to use some double bubble. We have a nice uh, canteen here. And of course, our tequila. We are using a Blanco tequila because what's gonna happen is it's going to take the flavoring and the smell from the double bubble and, and it'll be a tequila with, that smells like, like bubble gum and has a little bit of a taste of bubble gum. I purchased a nice tub of 340 pieces. I'm gonna use about half of this and a regular bottle of three fourths of a liter of, of tequila, mix it all together. We're gonna to put it in there for about uh, maybe two to seven days, depending on how long it takes to take out the, that pink color and that smell from the, from the, from the bubble gum. And um, then we can get to taste it. I'm getting to my last three bubble gums here. This is definitely more labor intensive than I, than I thought it was gonna be. But in here, I have about 170 pieces of bubble gum. Um, you know, definitely this bubble gum is a classic. I remember it as a kid, smells great, double bubble. For the tequila, like I mentioned, I'm gonna be using this Blanco. This is Tequila Partida. Purchased this at Costco quite a, quite, quite some, some time ago. Um, but it is a pretty good quality tequila. It is a Blanco, which has always has that agave smell to it. Um, yeah, it's, a, it's actually a very smooth um, tequila with agave smell. So we're gonna pretty much pour this whole bottle into here as such. Blows that up. Get a little swish there. Little pieces are stuck on top there. And that is gonna stay in here for some time. I'm thinking two to seven days. Um, and I, we expect the gum to, to, to pretty much go down a little bit, release all the pink, but most, most importantly, release all that smell that we're gonna get. So super excited, see you guys in a couple days. After infusing it for about five to six days, now we're gonna see what it actually smells like. I haven't opened it since then. I saran wrapped the top just so that it contains the alcohol in there. From here, I can already smell that, that gum smell, just smells super sweet. We can actually say that that is probably the strongest uh, gum I've ever smelled. So in order to taste it, I'm gonna take my little cup here, pour a little bit in there. So it doesn't spill. You can still smell a slight alcohol on it, um, but definitely that gum, that double bubble, classic smell. So now to taste it. It tastes like hard gum. Really, it, 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 it tastes like gum, super sweet. Um, the color is just beautiful, that dark pink actually. Super excited to have other, other people taste it. Highly recommend you doing this. I've now poured it back into the tequila bottle. Uh, it's a little syrupy, probably from all that sugar that it took on there, but the color is just gorgeous. I mean, it is this darker pink, just a beautiful color. This will be great to put on any table and I'm pretty sure people would love to taste it.